Hey YouTube. Chris for the Handyguard channel here on July 13th, 2014. And this is just a quick video of a uh, repair I'm going to attempt on my high pressure hose. For you dredgers out there, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. That's this two inch hose, which is the direct output of the water pump, which goes into the jets that create suction for the main intake dredge hose. But I sprung a leak last uh, last day I was out dredging. I ran a screw into it to see if I could stop the leak, which was not effective. It still squirted past the screw. So today I'm going to uh, try to effect a repair that will get me through the season with a couple layers of Gorilla Tape. It's a really heavy duty adhesive tape followed by sort of rubber boot that I'm going to turn inside out so the smooth side is against the hose and then I'm going to apply this metal container that came with the boot which you can open up and get around the hose with an additional third clamp right in the center right on the hole so we'll see if that will stem the leak got plenty of hose clamps and rubber boot which was originally configured as a ring. I had to slit it, I had to cut it so I can fit it around. But it has ridges. It used to have a really big ridge in the center that I trimmed down. And I'm going to put it with the smooth side in. So we'll see if that works. I'll try to give you a little shot of each step along the way. Okay, now I got my black Gorilla Tape on the whole one double wrap. And I have been joined by my partner, Alan Mash, What's who's up? on his way downstream. I forgot my hat, so my little head's going to burn today. <laughs> oh well, I'll help you get the seaweed off the dredge. Thank you. While you're working over there. Uh, we, we could have a little sushi while we're at it. Yeah, I think yeah. it's good for you. Yeah, it's miso cool. soup. It's like kelp. Okay, that will all be edited out. There's my black tape. Step one. We got step two on there, which is the... Uh, the final step, two and final step, which uh, this was actually some sort of a hose coupler or a hose mending kit. It had an inner rubber cylinder with the outer metal. The metal could be split, you know, came apart and you could get it around the hose, but the uh, original rubber was like a tube, so I had to slice it so I could fit it around my hose without taking the couplers off the end. So the leak is... Uh, Fully covered, got a band right around the center, which should be right on the hole itself. Got them crunched down pretty tight. So we'll fire it up and see if we got any leakage. Looks like we're successful. We don't have any leaks. I don't detect any drips, no runs, no errors, and that should get me through the season. Good deal. All right, we're back in business. That's my do it yourself repair of your high pressure hose on your dredge so you can keep getting gold video. Hope you enjoyed it.